Okay, it is uh, 12.04 on Saturday the 12th. Um, yeah, it's kind of an unusual situation. Um, let me tell you about it. I think it's good, but it may look bad, or it may look efficient. I don't know. We shall see. <laughs> Okay, here we are in the bowels of New Haven, Connecticut. <laughs> I don't know if I'm below sea level or not, but anyway, my deck is empty and it's Saturday, and why is that? Well, let me explain. I may have covered this in a previous video. Um, where I'm parked right now is just off of a main road, and they actually brought a truck with one of those, those hooks, and they just parked their truck next to mine, they pulled uh, the utility poles off my trailer and put it on there, signed my paperwork. And what had happened is yesterday I had to clarify the address because uh, my assignment gave me one address and the paperwork they provided was a different address. It was the same street but it was a, uh, a, a big difference in the number for the location. And it's a good thing I I called, they provide numbers so we can call the customers in case there's confusion like this. Um, otherwise I would have been two miles down the road trying to deliver in the middle of houses. <laughs> so I wasn't sure exactly where this was going to go so I called and they gave me specific, you know, says this is the address, or they gave me the address I needed to go to and then they broke it down to saying all you have to do is go up this highway, get off this exit, turn left and right before the train trestle which is this, if you go back that way you will uh, there's a train the train tracks go over the road that I was on just turn in there go back until you get to the scales and park there you'll be good and so I said all right I'll be there uh, you know I was picking this up on Friday morning and I was calling Friday morning and they said uh, I said I can you know I'll see you on Monday uh, for the delivery, because that's when it was scheduled for. And he goes, well, are, are you, when are you going to be up here? And I says, oh, I'll, I'll probably be up there uh, <laughs> tomorrow morning, Saturday. And just, you know, because I, I just park at a close truck stop, so when Monday arrives, I can drive straight here. Well, he's like, well, shoot, um, I'm working, so why don't you just come on by, you know, if you're here, I'll unload you. I was like, okay. I like that. So that, that should cover my Monday morning before 10 delivery requirement <laughs> is what this was scheduled for. <clears throat> so I'm unloaded on, on Saturday at noon. I'm going to drive seven miles down the road to a TA and uh, I should be starting my uh, getting a new 34 hour reset there, which is not a problem. I have movies galore on my laptop. And in fact, my old laptop that died, I got it fixed. So now I got two laptops. What should I do? Hmm. I'm sure one of my kids will want it. Or my wife. Somebody's going to want the extra one. They won't allow me to have two. So I will, uh, that's it for now. I'm going to the TA. I'll bust out the camera and let you see what it look, what my look, my weekend's going to look like. Um, I may have to post a short video after this just to, if I can't find Wi-Fi, to let people know sorry no videos this week but we shall see maybe that's premature of me to even say that because if I get videos uploaded then it's a moot point off to TA okay I didn't make it down the road because the highway is all blocked up I only had to go like two more miles but I'm like hey here's a service plaza they have truck stop I mean they got truck parking and odds are yeah the, <laughs> as soon as I left there it started raining um, they have Subway, McDonald's, a couple other things. So they have more than what the TA has because they've got like Subway and that's it. And truck stop food kind of sucks. So at least they have like a convenience store and some other stuff in here. So, And the other main reason I stopped here is because oftentimes at these service plazas, they have free Wi-Fi. So if they do have free Wi-Fi, then that'll be a good thing. That'll be definitely a good thing. So here's my empty clean trailer, my rain-washed truck, and all these empty spaces because it's 1 o'clock, 
and hopefully Monday uh, will be the day that I get my assignment because <laughs> I don't see them giving me anything during the weekend because it makes it really hard to get a 34 hour reset if they were to give me something new and say hey since you're empty <laughs> so but that'll be a lesson learned I like lessons learned I'm, I learn all kinds of lessons in this job all kinds of lessons so I guess oh I talked to the the good thing about being a, a truck driver when there is uh, traffic congestion the CBs allow us to communicate and be like hey there's an accident uh, mile marker 54 you need to be in the left hand lane so while all these cars are trying to get into the right hand lane all you'll see all the when you see trucks merging into one particular lane while you're driving down the road that's because that's probably the lane to be in so hopefully I didn't give away a secret <laughs>